Everyone, I am Nagita Natalin. I am junior high student of SMP Sasta SSC 3 Binanga. I want to tell you a story about the first president of Indonesia. The title is Insinyur Sukarno is an Indonesian hero. Actually, he is not only a hero, but also a great inspiration too. I chose him because I think he is the great orator who was ever born in Indonesia. Many people were influenced by him until now. But not all people in the world know him. So, I want to tell you a story about him. Sukarno was the only son of a poor Japanese school teacher. Raden Sukamisa Radiharjo and his Balinese wife, Ida Nyomandra. He was born in Blitar, East Java, on June 10, 1901. He was named Kusno Sosro Diharjo, but he was renamed Sukarno because he often got ill. There was a story when he was born. Sukarno was born in the morning, and there was a myth that the child who was born when the sun rises will be predicted to be a big figure on his time. Many people call him son of the sun. Stories about his childhood is known that he had a great attitude to communicate with other people. Grow up as a talented boy, Sukarno continued his study to HBS in Surabaya. Then he went to Institute of Technology in Bandung on Civil Department. He spent only three years to finish his study. He is not only a smart student, but also active in movement party called PNR. When he was released, he became a popular hero. He was arrested several times during the 1930s and was put in jail when Japan occupied the RCP Lago in 1942. In 1943, Sukarno married Fatma Wati. Then on November 10, 1943, Sukarno became the leader of BBUPKI that was supported by Japan. Finally, on August 17, 1945, Indonesia declared the Independence Day and he became the first president of Indonesia. And Sukarno's wife, Mrs. Fatmawati, she with the Indonesian flag by herself. Sukarno passed away in 1970 and was buried in Blitar, Java. Indonesian people were full of sadness. Although he had gone, his spirit is still alive and influences many people until now. Now, we as teenagers should fulfill this independence by study hard. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Happy Independence Day!